Hello friends, this video on quadratic equations part 7 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 6. Now we have solved so many questions by factorization. Let's solve some question by completing square. It's another method to solve a quadratic equation. Let's try this example x square plus 4x minus. Here, what we try to do? We try to find the equation in this form x minus k whole square is equal to let's suppose k1 square is equal to k2 square. This kind of form we want to find. Here, if you see x square plus 4x, right? x square plus 4x I can write in this form x square plus 2 into 2x, 2 into 2 into x. If you see, observe clearly, we know that x plus 2 whole square is nothing but x square plus 2 into 2 into x plus 4. Correct. So, in this thing, if we can add 4 and subtract 4, it's all the same, right? Minus 5 was there, so I wrote minus 5. I have just added and subtracted 4. But the advantage I got is this whole thing I can now write as x plus 2 whole square. And this is a constant part I got, right? This I can write nothing but x plus 2 whole square minus 9 that is minus 3 square is equal to 0. I can write in this form. See, this is the form I was looking for x plus k1, x plus k1 square is equal to k2 square or minus k2 square is equal to 0, same thing. Here I have seen that x square plus 4x, if I add 4 and subtract 4 with this, no harm. But when I take this part, 4x, 4 part, this is nothing but x plus 2 whole square. And this I can write 3 square. So this is nothing but I can say that x plus 2 square is nothing but 3 square. If I remove the root, I will get x plus 2 is equal to plus minus 3 because even a negative number of square becomes 9 right this is 9 if you take a root of 9 this is plus minus 3 so I will say x is equal to plus 3 minus 2 or minus 3 minus 2 or I can say x is equal to 1 or minus 4. that is my answer very simple I have tried to convert this form of equation into this form this x plus some constant square, it can be 0 also, is equal to, this is also a square, constant square. So in this form, it was 4x, 4x is nothing but 2 into 2x, and formula we know that x plus 2 whole square is nothing but x square plus 4x plus 4. So if I add, subtract 4, I can get x plus 2 whole square, right? And that's what I have done. I'll solve some examples to make concept clear. Let's take an example, 2x square minus 7x plus 3 is equal to 0. Since I am familiar with x square minus some let's suppose 2 into kx plus k square form, right? So this is nothing but x plus k whole, x minus k whole square or x square plus 2kx plus k square form. This is x plus 2k whole square, x plus k whole square. I will first write everything in x square only. I will remove this 2. So what I'll get, I'll take 2 common, this becomes x square minus 7 by 2x plus 3 by 2 is equal to 0. This 2 I can cancel because this becomes 0 by 2 becomes 0. Correct. So now this is x square minus 7 by 2x plus 3 by 2. Now what I can do, I can write this is this, is this form, x square minus 2 into x into 7 by 4. Because we have this form x square into x square minus 2 into k into x, x square into k into this is k into x. So here I'll do k square plus minus. That is plus 7 by 4 k square minus 7 by 4 k square. Plus 3 by 2 is equal to 0. Very simple. See the logic is we know that x square minus or plus 2 kx plus k square is equal to this is x minus k whole square and this is x plus k whole square. I know these values. 
So here also I have converted into this form x square minus 2 into x into k. Since this was k because 7 by 2 is nothing but 2 into 7 by 4. So I have subtracted and added 7 by 4 square, right? Because k square was required here. So this I can sorry, this is one part I'll take and this is another part I'll take, right? So this becomes x minus 7 by 4 whole square. Let me is equal to, I'll take this side, 7 by 4 square minus 3 by 2. Correct? This is nothing but 16. 7 square is 49. And this is since it's 16, I have to multiply by 8. 3 into 8 is 24. And this is nothing but 49 minus 24 is 25 by 16. It is nothing but 5 by 4 square. Correct? So the equation I have is x minus 7 by 4 square is equal to 5 by 4 square. And that is what I was looking for. I was looking for x minus k1 square is equal to k2 square. If I am having in this form, I can say that x minus 7 by 4 is equal to plus minus 5 by 4. Correct? That is x minus 7 by 4 is equal to 5 by 4 or x minus 7 by 4 is equal to minus 5 by 4. If I, this is 5 by 4 plus 5 by 4. If I take this case, my x comes out to be 12 by 4. That is 3. If I take this case, x comes out to be 7 by 4 minus 5 by 4. That is 2 by 4, that is 1 by 2. So my the value of x is 3 or 1 by 2. That is the answer. Very simple. I have written this in this form. x square minus 2 into kx. I found k was 7 by 4. So I have added 7 by 4 square, subtracted 7 by 4 square. And then I got x minus 7 by 4 square is equal to 5 by 4 square, which is what I was looking for. And then x minus 7 by 4 is nothing but plus minus 5 by 4. So two values of x possible, case 1, case 2 and got the answer. Let's take one more example. 2x square plus x minus 4 is equal to 0. Here also since I know the equation of this form x square plus 2kx plus k square. This form equation I know. So I'll just divide by 2. This becomes 2 into x square plus x by 2 minus 4 by 2 is equal to 0. This 2 I can remove. This becomes x square plus 2 into x into 1 by 4. Since it is 1 by 4, I have to add and sub subtract 1 by 4 square. So I will say plus 1 by 4 square minus 1 by 4 square minus 2 is equal to 0. 4 by 2 is 2. Correct? So this becomes x plus 1 by 4 square is equal to 1 by 4 square plus 2. That is 1 by 16 plus 2. That is nothing but 16 I'll take here. 1 plus 32. That is nothing but 33 by 16. So if I write this is this form or that is nothing but root 33 by 4 whole square. So I can write equation in this form x plus 4 square is nothing but root 33 by 4 square. Exactly this is the form I was looking for x minus k1 square is equal to or x plus k1 square is equal to k2 square. Same thing. So I can write in this form x plus 1 by 4 is equal to plus minus root 33 by 4. That is x plus 1 by 4 is equal to root 33 by 4 or x plus 1 by 4 is equal to minus root 33 by 4. This is minus. Correct? So what I got is in this case, I get x is equal to nothing but root 33 minus 1 by 4. In this case, what I get is x is equal to minus root 33 
minus 1 by 4 and that is my answer the values of x plus root 33 minus 1 root 33 minus 1 by 4 or minus root 33 minus 1 by 4 here also is very simple I just written equation in this form x square plus 2kx form and got the thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again